Hey guys, it's Alicia here. Uh, for today's video, I just want to do a laid back video of a haul of some stuff that I got from Target and a few things from Walgreens. And I don't have like too much stuff that I want to show, just a few things because I thought it would be fun. Um, there's only one thing I got that's not hair care. Literally everything else is, so I'll go ahead and show that one first. This is the number seven Radiant Results Nourishing Cleansing Balm. I got this at Target. Um, I really like clean. Oop, I really just wore that box. I really like cleansing balms. Um, comes a little cloth too. I've never tried the number seven one. But I have tried one from Pixie and I really, really liked it. So I thought, you know, I may, may as well try something new. So that's what it looks like. I have read reviews about this that it's like a dupe for the um, Clinique Take the Day Off Cleansing Balm. I've never tried that one, but I just want to give that a try. I believe it was only like $7.99, $8.99. I think it was around $8.99. So not too expensive. Um... Something else that I got from Target was the Nexus Clean and Pure Invigorating Detox Scalp Scrub. I really like this stuff. This is my second one of these. Um, I am like almost gone with the one I have. So I went ahead and purchased another one because I really, really like this stuff. This stuff is about $14, $15. I think it is totally worth the money. It really helps um, with dryness if you get flaky. And it says it's for like oily hair. So... I think, honestly, anybody could use this, probably. But yeah, I got that. Something else that I got, this is something I've never tried. It's the Kristen S. Style Reviving Dry Conditioner. I've never tried dry conditioner before, but I do have a couple dry shampoos that I use. I just want to try a dry conditioner and, you know, see if I like it. It says it's instantly softening, shine boosting, and weightlessly moisturizing. Oil and odor absorbing, UV and heat protection. So yeah, I think this was also around $14. Um, I've never tried anything from this brand before, but I'm really excited too. I like dry shampoo, but like, I feel like it absorbs the oil, but I feel like it'll make my hair like so dry. So I'm hoping that this will kind of like salvage that situation. And then the last couple things I got, one was these I got at Walgreens. From Maui Moisture, oh, dang it, well, yeah, I did get this one. From Maui Moisture, I got this at Target. It's the Detoxifying and Volcanic Ash Scalp Care Mask. I've never tried this particular mask from Maui before, but I do really like um, a couple other Maui's masks. I like the one that has Shia in it, and it's the pink, uh, it's the pink um, tub, and it's, it's supposed to, like, heal and hydrate. Um, for dry hair and then I also really love the smooth and repair vanilla bean hair mask that looks just like this except it's the uh, vanilla bean one I bought that one at Walgreens and I thought that I grabbed it but I grabbed this one instead but I did get this one at Target I just totally forgot that I got it so I'm gonna use this first um, and then I'll use my vanilla bean after I use up this one because I've never tried this one before and I'm really curious if I like it but I want to try it since it says it's for scalp care. Um, I really know that I love the other one, the vanilla bean. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. It makes your hair smell like sugar cookies. It smells so good. It really softens my hair and tames down my frizz. So I really do like it. So I had to repurchase it. And then I also got to try out, because I've never tried these out before, the matching Maui Moisture Smooth and Repair Vanilla Bean Shampoo and Conditioner. I've never tried these before, but I really wanted to give it a try. Um, they had a sale at Walgreens, buy two, get third free on their hair care. So I bought these two and then got the matching hair mask for free because, like I said, I do love that one and I was planning on repurchasing it anyways. So I thought may as well try out the shampoo and conditioner to see if it really helps with my frizz. I like the shampoo and conditioner I'm using right now, but I just thought I would try something different. Let's see if I like it. But yeah, that's pretty much everything that I got. I do have a bag full of makeup items to try out that I got at Walgreens, Walmart, and Target, but I am saving it for a future video. I just wanted to share some other things that I got because I was really excited about all this stuff. I can't wait to try it out. 
Um, but yeah, sorry this is like a way shorter video than what I normally do, but I just thought I would share everything that I got. You'll probably see a lot of these in my empties videos that I will be doing, so yeah. But that was all for this video. I hope that you enjoyed watching such a short video, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!